if, if, you, if you go to a perf perfume house and you start to learn raw materials, after 10 years you may know a thousand materials. If you learn this system, you'll know a thousand materials within about two or three weeks. <laughs> yeah? So. And how guess the terminology? Oh, C9C citrus fatty. Yes. C10C fatty citrus. So, how do you know how to define them better? It'll be more fatty than the more citrus. Okay. Now, really, really important for this is there are no words to explain smells. Yeah, only smells can explain smells. Yeah, so the purpose of this is to is to catch what the difference is between C9 and C8. But you're, the reason that the other way round is that it's more fatty than citrus. Yeah, like as it gets bigger. C10 will be more fatty than C9. Yes, yes, yeah, yeah. And this is orange and lemonish, so this is going to be more on the orange side, and this will be on the tangerine side. The fatty uh, yeah, more orangey and less, yeah, yeah, more orangey, actually. Yeah, it's going yeah. to be a little more yeah. tangy yeah. and more sour. And actually, this is, the, this is the component that's responsible for the smell of oranges, C10. Oh. One of the purposes of this is, is, remember, there are no words to describe smells. Yeah, the idea is, is to catch the idea of what C10 smells like, what aldehydes smell like. And then, it, then they become like building blocks you can put in your mind. Oh, phenolethyl is rose. Yeah. As soon as you've got it, put, put your hand up and they'll give you the materials, yeah. Yeah, yeah, otherwise it gets too smelly. <laughs> Perfect. I oh, know, I was just smelling the CH. Mm, so, uh, okay. Oh, okay, maybe. Yeah. Not ready yet. You get this? Yeah. Does it make sense? Okay. <laughs> but but please, important point of this exercise is that there are no words to describe smells. Yeah? Smell are not words. Smell is, yeah? And the idea is to, to get what aldehyde smells like, what C10 smells like. Because once you get that, you can, you can almost, when you see a name, the smell jumps out at you. Yeah? You don't have to, like, do your, your physically writing, yeah? fresh chemical, but once you get what C8 smells like, has a particular type of smell. <laughs> so if the C8, that C8 chain is in a completely different molecule, it's like, ah, oh, I, can, I can sort of smell that, that influence. So there are no words for smells. Yeah? Words are just signposts towards the smell, just to give you a clue <laughs> of where you might find it. Are you ready? No. Okay. Uh, so do the, do that block. Okay. Yeah, do that block of A. Yeah, and then we'll give you these. To okay, you've done the, you've done the five, so you can. So C8 to C12, and then compare to what you got. There's just one set because it gets really strong otherwise. <laughs>